I wanted to show you this. This is a Wheeling power supply made in March 89. Model number is HDAF HDA dash DF dash 14. There's another video of mine. I've done this before. This is an older model. Um, it's got four outputs. And your positive and negative over here. So, what we're going to do is talk a little bit about what is wrong with this one. Or what was wrong with this one. See the inside of the case, there was some leakage there. Capacitor was dried out. One of these was leaking. Also, this 2200 microfarad capacitor was bad as well. So, it's 2200 microfarad, 50 volt. These, I were able, I took these off of another one that I had, so I'm not sure what the value were on them. I think it was 4,500 4, microfarad, or, I don't remember the value. But anyway, they'll be listed on the capacitor when you take them off, if you need to change them out, if they're leaking like this. So... This is all ready to go. I've resoldered some stuff, put in the new capacitors in there. In order to take it open, you have to rib, uh, drill the rivet out. So <clears throat> I'm going to verify that this is working. And once I do that, I'm going to put the rivets back into them. So let's, I'm going to do a test right now, make sure these outputs are blinking okay so inside my little red solo cup is the flash bulb I get it to the first output we're connected and my positive negative right here I don't have the proper connection right now and my power supply set at 14 volts we're going to see that thing flash on apply voltages. Hopefully we won't have anything go up in smoke. That's cool. It's working. That is the it's supposed to be um, A is alternate, which is flashing pretty constant. Not sure which is which on this. Um, kind of happy that that's working. So we're going to go on to this port here. And you see that that's working. Okay, there's a fourth one. Yeah, it's working. And then the last port. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you next time.